Good morning, everybody. Today is Monday, the 28th of December, 2015. Now, in my study today, I was going over um, the discussion that Jesus had with Nicodemus. Now, Nicodemus was a Pharisee, and he would come to see Jesus at night. And he basically... Um, talked to Jesus. He said, Rabbi, we know that you come from heaven because nobody can do what you, what you do. Jesus came back and said, well, nobody can, nobody can uh, be uh, saved. I mean, you know, p people have to be saved unless they're reborn. This troubled Nicodemus. He did not understand it. He was a teacher. He was a scholar. He tried to figure this out. And Jesus explained to them that someone has to be born of the water instead of going into their mother's womb. And when they're born and they accept the Holy Spirit into their lives, they are saved. The follow-through on that is being baptized through water. When this was explained, uh, he still was troubled, but yet the Lord continued on. Back, if you remember, uh, well, in, when the, they were in the desert, there were some snakes biting him, biting the Israelites. What ended up happening, uh, God told uh, Moses to make a brass snake and put it up on a high stick. When the people looked at that, they would be healed. Jesus assured Nicodemus that as Moses was lifted up, he would be lifted up. Now the meaning behind um, that being lifted up is that Jesus knew that he was going to go to the cross. He knew he was going to be betrayed. And then the meaning with the discussion, other discussion with Nicodemus, he knew that the reason for going to the cross is to free the world from sin and eternal condemnation. These are important concepts. If you wish to be saved, you can be reborn. The birth of Jesus was just a couple of days ago. And that's what it represents. The Son of God coming down to free all of us from sin. So thank you for watching this and have a blessed Monday. And thank you for observing and viewing this two minutes with Peter.